you know anything about God remains in Chingsa village? <sighs> Even the history books have no record of this. The only ones who'll know anything are those old fogies who have been hanging around here since the beginning of time. Hmm. Didn't you used to be on good terms with the Adepti, though? You sure they didn't tell you anything about this? Well, uh... <clears throat> Changsheng's memories and powers are not what they were in her prime. These days, she has to enter a contract with a mortal and share their life force just to sustain her own life. I fear that such ancient events are long gone from her memory by now. Whoa, what? After a contract? Share life force? Sounds like some pretty spooky sorcery if you ask Paimon. Hey, plenty of people would jump at the chance to join forces with a powerful being like me. With my assistance in rebalancing your chi, not only can you extend your lifespan, but you will also be stronger, healthier, and able to eat whatever you like with no risk of upsetting your stomach. Stronger and healthier? Wow, that's amazing! Uh, Baiju, maybe when you retire, you can let Paimon sign a contract with Changsheng for a few days. <laughs> Unfortunately, Changsheng's contract has strict requirements regarding the host's temperament. None of her hosts have ever been exempted from these rules. I fear that I will be unable to accommodate your wishes, Paimon. Temperament? Uh, hey! What are you trying to say? Did you just subtly insult Paimon to her face? Why your natural temperament makes you woefully unsuited to being my host. <laughs> 